person who has the answers to all of your questions <laughs> concerning the possibility of snow. Uh, Kelly Bayern's in the Weather Center. And mm -hmm. Are we going to see some more snow at higher elevations this week? Yes, we, we, we may. I think Tuesday night into Wednesday could be a time frame where we see more moisture rolling in. That over the cold temperatures that'll stick around this week. Another chance for some snowfall up towards those elevations again near Washougal, Camas, and the west end of the, of the gorge. I think we'll see another round of that as we head into Tuesday night. Right now, we're still sticking with some rain showers pushing through Portland. Also out towards the coast, it is wet. We are seeing rain showers out towards seaside and down the coastline. Right now in Portland, it is uh, mainly rain that is falling here. We're still a little warm to see any snow, but up at those higher elevations, if you are sitting at about a thousand feet, uh, you could see some flurries mixed in as uh, these showers push on through. But also today, we do start to dry out, so we'll keep things mainly cloudy. Over the weekend, we saw that snow for the lower elevations. The mountains also finally got another dousing of snow. Uh, here's the view from Timberline. I went skiing on Sunday and uh, it was beautiful up there. All those trees coated in some new snow. Our ski report last 24 hours, three to six inches, both for Meadows and Timberline. Mount Bachelor picked up about five inches. Uh, some good snowfall, a good round of some snow for the Cascades over the weekend. And we'll see plenty of snow this week for Mount Hood and the Oregon Cascades as a number of weather systems roll in and we stay fairly cold up towards the mountains. Uh, this morning we're sitting with with temperatures in the mid 30s now. There's your view of the Moto Center from the coin tower cameras uh, from downtown. We're in the upper 30s now. A chance we still see a scattered rain shower this morning, but uh, we'll see some dry hours this morning and also throughout the afternoon to get outside for a walk. Uh, again, these showers that do push through this morning will stay mainly light and in Portland at least they'll fall as rain. We're just a little too warm to see any snow here. Winds are mainly in from the south at about 5 to 10 miles per hour. So here's a rainfall future cast. As we head into today, notice how we get that big blank spot, that dry uh, patch uh, through the valley here in Portland. It's that rain shadow. We'll still keep some showers pushing in uh, towards the coast and out towards the Cascade and coast foothills here, but mainly dry and cloudy in Portland. Our next weather system rolls in as we head into Tuesday. And by the afternoon, as that rain starts to arrive, as we get some cold air pushing in, into Portland from the uh, west end of the gorge. I do see a chance to see more foothill snowfall and even in Portland on the east side. There are some models that point to some light snow uh, falling just on the east sides of Portland. So we'll watch that very closely. This model again pointing to all rain. We see that warmer south flow keeping temperatures just above uh, freezing. So the, a better chance we see mainly rain or rain snow mix with little to no accumulation. But we'll watch Tuesday night very closely. I do see out towards the gorge and the east sides of Portland. We could possibly see some snow falling. So we'll track that very closely as we head into tonight and we see some model updates and going into Wednesday morning, still tracking some snow fallout towards the west end of the gorge. The areas that I see uh, could pick up some issues uh, from snow could be towards Cascade Locks and Hood River. So notice as this forecast goes into Wednesday morning, uh, we could pick up even some snow down to I-84 or those foothills. So we'll track that too. Again, it's going to be Tuesday night into Wednesday uh, that we could see those snowy issues. Uh, today though, we'll keep things mainly cloudy. A few scattered showers here and there in the valley, but a mainly dry day. Low 40s for our highs. Also a little cooler today. We'll stay in the upper 30s tomorrow. A chilly day, but back to the mid to upper 40s as we head into the week. Again, Tuesday night and Wednesday will be another time frame we watch for some lower elevation snow. Carly, how are the roads? Well, we've got a crash right